The Give Me 5 test generator includes tests for each unit of the course. But what if you want to create your own test to check specific language or skills based on the needs of your pupils? Click Create a new test and you'll see this menu appear. Let's make a test for Unit 5. You can either let the test generator randomly select exercises to include on the test paper, or if you prefer, you can select specific exercises one by one. For this test, I've decided that I only want to test the pupils on reading and writing. For the reading paper, I have three possible items to include. A matching exercise, a gap fill exercise, and a circling exercise. This last one includes a grammar point, which we haven't studied closely yet, so I'm just going to choose the first two exercises, which recycle some vocabulary from the unit. You can see that I've already selected two exercises for my test so far. You can click this arrow to temporarily collapse the menu. The test generator will remember which exercises you've already chosen. For the writing part of the test, I want to see an example of my pupil's extended writing. So I'm not going to include this exercise. And I'm not going to include this one. But I am going to include this exercise. And you can see that this is worth more points on the test than the other exercises because it's more challenging. I'm going to call my test Unit 5 reading and writing. And before I save it, I want to see what it looks like. If my students are studying in the same physical classroom and sitting closely next to each other, I can create an A version and a B version of the test to prevent cheating. If there's listening material in my test, I can check the audio here. And I can generate a PDF to print or send to the pupils by clicking here. I can also create an answer key for myself by clicking Yes next to Show Answers, and then clicking Create PDF. When I open the PDF, I can see the answers to the reading exercises, and also some model answers for the writing exercise. I can now save this PDF on my computer and close the window to go back to the test generator. Click Close Preview to return to the main screen. If you're happy with your test, click Save so you'll easily be able to find it and use it again in future.